Are you a Star Wars fan? Do you want to print the acclimator from Star Wars Clone Wars and Star Wars Original Trilogy? Join me inside as we take this all the way to the Cura, all the way to print. See you inside. Hello and welcome to today's video. Today we are printing the acclimator from Star Wars Clone Wars and the Star Wars prequel trilogy. So let's get some business out of the way first. Hit that subscribe button, hit that like button if you're enjoying what you're seeing today. The subscribe and likes really mean a lot to me. I do appreciate it and it helps out the channel get moving forward. As you can see, we've got the model loaded into Cura here and it is just way too big for my build plate. I'm using a CR10. Um, so we're gonna shrink this guy down, get it set, get it angled to where I can get the majority of it on the build plate. As you can see, we've had to shrink it down pretty good. Um, now, one thing that you can do here is you could take this model in the mesh mixer and separate the two pieces. That way you can print one at a time. That way you can print it bigger. But I'm not doing that for this example. As you can see, oh, I just made it too big again. Got to shrink it down again. We're going to get it just around that bill plate. I bet my RAV setting is off here a little bit, but we're going to adjust that and get that squared down just enough. There we go. Now we're on the bill plate. We're looking good. Um, I am going to use a raft for this print to keep it adhered to the bed. We're a little too high right now, so we're going to shrink that down. And we are using Inland PLA White Pro Plus to do the print today on the CR10. So we're going to go through and make sure we got all of our settings right, make it sure everything looks good. And we're going to get this guy printed up. So um, if you stick till the end, you'll see that we've got it um, printed. Um, this model did have a problem printing, unfortunately, but... We're gonna correct that issue um, in another video. Um, as I discussed in my top five failures video, if you didn't catch that video, go check it out. Um, it's a good video that talks about the top five failures that I've seen with 3D printing. Um, we did suffer one of those prints where if you see in the time lapse at the end of the stop motion that we did in the back fin, it warped while it was on the printer, pro probably because my bed plate was too hot. Um, it caused some warping because I did check, my plate is actually level so it's not a warp in my plate but as you can see here we're kind of sizing up see how it's going to build on the plate with the bridge module and that being the last piece and here we go into the time lapse Right, and this is the finalized model. Thank you guys for taking the time to watch. Remember, hit that subscribe button, hit that like button, and we will see you in the next time lapse.